Hi everyone, Mike here. Hope you're having a fantastic day. And if you're training for an upcoming event, that your training is going well. This is a personal message from me to you. After many long conversations with my family, my wife Rose, and some close friends, and after over a thousand endurance events over the last 40 years, 210 Ironman since 1989, yelling out those words almost a half a million times. At the end of this year, I'll be hanging up my microphone. Very tough decision because besides my family, you have always been so close a family to me. Decision simple, it is about family. I've missed so many anniversaries, so many birthdays, so many parties, so many vacations with friends. And I don't want to repeat that cycle with my grandsons. I want to be there all the time. Sure, I can give the excuses of travel and it's tougher and all that, but you know, I always loved that. I look forward to things that other people who said tore them down. I look forward to getting to you at the finish line. To the Ironman Corporation, specifically Andrew Messick, you're a great friend and a great leader. Diana Birch, you have built the championship events into what they are today. And Shane Facto, from a 19-year-old I met in Lake Placid to now the COO of the company, all three of you have given me your undying support and respect. And I appreciate that more than you know. To all the pros out there, past, present, future, the past pros, you set a foundation that is so strong today. And you new pros are setting levels that none of us thought we'd ever see. But always know your actions speak louder than your words. To all the other announcers I've worked with over the years, this sport's in good shape with you on the microphones. You'll take care of our age group athletes and everyone and I have no problem handing you my microphone. To all the roadies that put together the events and the operations team that I'm a part of, being with you all and laughing, belly laughing so many times, I'll miss that an awful lot. And you age groupers, you have filled my heart and soul more than you can imagine. What I've seen you overcome over the years of people telling you you couldn't do it. Overcoming cancer, overcoming diseases, overcoming loss of a loved one or a child. Yet, you found the internal fortitude to get to that finish line. I couldn't have asked for more and how it has built me as a person. You've given me so much more than I could have ever given you. The remaining schedule, I can't wait to see you. I've got six more events this year, Ironman Wisconsin, Kona, the Ironman World Championship. That'll be a tough last one, as they all will be. Ironman California, I'll see you at Ironman Florida, Ironman Arizona, and the last one of the season the last one of my season, will be at Ironman New Zealand in December. I hope I can see all my Kiwi and Aussie friends there. So always know that I'm with you in spirit, no matter where your finish line is, no matter where you find it. We've had the best of times together. I, no bad times. I hope that I've taken care of you the way you've wanted to be taken care of, to be able to be the one to proclaim what you did and who you are. One person doesn't deserve to be able to do all that. But for some reason, God chose me. Mahalo to each and every one of you. 
and so many of you are hearing this message and I would have liked to have had personal conversations with you and you know who you are, but it just wasn't possible. We'll talk. So to my family, thank you for being behind me constantly. Rose, Aaron, Andy, Andrew, Brianna, my loving brothers and sisters. I don't, I don't deserve you. Aloha. And I'm trying to think of one final thing to say, but there really isn't. My microphone was a joy to have in my hand. It's what I love to do. I'm not going anywhere. My podcast will still be out there solid. You want to keep up with me up at MikeRiley.net. Send me messages. What, 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 what you've been doing, I answer as many as I can. You know that. So be well, train hard, and always know your biggest lesson in life is finish what you start. And this is just not some moniker or a motto, or it's a saying that says it all. Love you all, and for the rest of my life, you will be with me. Aloha.